China's Air Force released new footage showing its GJ-11 stealth drone flying together with a J-20 stealth fighter and a J-16D electronic warfare aircraft, marking the first public display of coordinated flight among these aircraft. The GJ-11, which was previously nicknamed Sharp Sword, now renamed Dark Dragon, while the J-20 carries the established title Mighty Dragon, reflecting their integration within the same stealth-oriented operational framework. The GJ-11's configuration implies multiple potential roles, including deep penetration strike, surveillance, and decoy operations against advanced air defense networks, while the J-16DS electronic warfare equipment, believed to include wideband jammers and radar detection pods, can suppress enemy radar emissions to protect stealth aircraft such as the J-20 and J-35 aircraft. For instance, the GJ-11's flying wing configuration minimizes radar returns by eliminating vertical stabilizers and smoothing the airframe profile. The drone is approximately 14 meters in wingspan and 12 meters in length, with two internal bays estimated to hold four to six small diameter precision glide munitions or electronic payloads. The shielded exhaust outlet reduces infrared signature, while the serrated bay doors and composite materials limit radar reflection. The platform likely uses a single turbofan engine generating around 50 kN of thrust, providing subsonic cruise speeds with a combat radius possibly exceeding 1,200 km. Estimated endurance ranges from 4 to 6 hours, depending on payload configuration. Such specifications support long-duration reconnaissance and precision attack missions while maintaining low observability. The overall structure corresponds to an aircraft capable of operating independently or under remote guidance in complex electronic environments. These deployments imply ongoing evaluation of range performance, radar signature behavior, and communication stability at extended distances. Patterns of repeated sorties and simultaneous airframes indicate that coordinated mission sets, potentially simulating autonomous swarming, are being tested. Endurance assessments, weapon separation trials, and data link integration likely continue as part of the combat readiness evaluation. While official confirmation of operational service has not been issued, the frequency and distribution of activities point to an advanced test phase preceding limited squadron introduction.